Hello, here I am. I've got something to show you. Here it is. Can you see? Um, the lighting's not very good. That is the tooth. And I have a new dentist. Yay! My God, the most wonderful dentist. If you saw my previous video, you will know that um, I had a little bit of trouble with the dentist and you know me and stuff but and they didn't want to see me again so I had to find a new dentist well I did and I'm so happy you have no idea today well I saw them last week and they gave me another course of antibiotics before we decided to take this tooth out and I've just had it out uh, what's the time now oh, I'm looking at the clock it's now 13.24 on Thursday and today it was at 10.45 my appointment and he numbed me up good and this is what you look like when you're done down, you're swollen and that's fine um, excellent, got the tooth out really good and when I saw him last week he even put a fillet in it, filling in it, bless him there because that bit wasn't there if you saw my other video but he did that in so it looked a bit better for me I didn't ask, he just did it. He's just a really, really nice dentist. All the staff at that dentist, absolutely wonderful. Cannot fault them. And I'm so grateful to the gods, whoever, for letting me get a place in that dentist. Um, so there it is. Gross, eh? Yuck. But it's gone. Look. Try there's a bit of blood there. Gone. Yay. There we are. I've got my candles on. Look, spooky eyes. So yeah, really good. Feel glad it's out. I know I'm gonna hurt. I wanted to be sure. I put a lot of injections in, and um, but it come out in one piece, as you saw. And uh, just really glad I found them. Also sending me for an X-ray up here to check out the bone spurs and stuff. I did have an X-ray at that dentist last week up here that showed a little root tip from one of the extractions. So this could potentially be causing issues as well. But I'm just glad that one's gone. Um, prepared for dry socket, as always. Some of us just, that's just the way it is. But um, yeah, I had an adjustment on these as well, because this wasn't helping, this tooth, this little bugger here, was pushing up into the same spot where I think I got some spurs, but because I have to sleep in the denture, because I grind, you see, I tried sleeping without it, and I just ground these teeth, especially that, straight into the bit that's sore, but even with the denture on, it was like a pressure point, so the lovely, lovely denture lady's done um, an adjustment, so that sits a bit better. So here I am, looking a little bit Halloween-y, I've got mad hair, this is my natural hair, it's got a natural curl that I normally straighten out, but I didn't. I've got some of my candlesticks on, which is good. Oh, and a little scary mask over there. <laughs> like that. Anyway, here we are. Gone. And uh, just go have the face x-ray, and then he'll refer me. He'll have a good look at it, um, hopefully next week. And refer me to the hospital for any surgeries or anything that might need to be done if he can't do it. But yes. I just wanted to let you know I'm fine and wish you a happy Halloween, seeing as I look kind of Halloween-y. If I took these teeth out, I'd look like a witch. <laughs> you know, who needs fancy dress? But I'm not taking them out. No, they stay in. Oh yeah, I don't know if this light... It's a neat little hole. Inside is very sore. As I said, there's the blood bit on there. Oh. Anyway. As a little update, tooth extraction, yay! I do go numb, which I already knew, so that's cool. And this dentist is great, the lady who did my denture is great, and I thank them immensely, and the other staff at the new dentist as well, because every single one of them has been lovely to me. Lovely. That's it. I wish you all well. Not a lot else to say, except um, good luck. See, happy face, even if it's sore, happy, because somebody cared, it makes a massive difference. Thank you. Bye-bye.